can't think of anything more exciting than seeing what's going on here in Islandia right now. 3D printing a house, the guys are flying. I haven't been here in about three or four days and I can't believe how much progress they've made. This 3D printer is so efficient and with the right team and the right setup that we have, handsome home buyer, SQ4D, we're gonna be able to get this house done in a record three months versus your typical six to nine months on a traditional stick built house. And we're literally innovating in the field right now. So I wanna take you guys through the house, show you exactly what we've done because I've missed a lot again over the last couple of days. Well, the first thing we did was SQ4D laid down this heavy duty vapor barrier before we do anything. Obviously this is going to keep moisture from coming up into the house through the concrete because remember, concrete is porous. Moisture and water flow through it. So first things first, we put that down. Obviously you have the rebar because we're gonna be 3D printing unlike any other company, we're gonna be 3D printing the slab but I wanna show you guys the insulation and also the way the electric is being run. SQ4D took two inch insulation board. Similar to the insulation board that you see that people put over a house before they put the siding on. Insulation board, Tyvek, siding. They put it here around the entire perimeter, even the garage, to keep the house as energy efficient as humanly possible. Probably one of the most unique things that we're doing on this particular project is SQ4D came up with this Haunch design. Essentially what that is, it's a miniature footing, approximately 12 inches deep, that goes where each interior wall is gonna be. They put rebar, they 3D print the haunches, and this adds that extra structural rigidity. This house is as solid as you can get. So if you notice here, this is one of the haunches going through. This is where all the interior walls are gonna be for the bedrooms, outlining the hallway. You're gonna have the two 3D printed walls here, and the five inch void in the middle, that's exactly, exactly what you see where this spray paint is, is exactly where the wall is going to be. Perhaps the most interesting part of what we're doing here is the electric system. So my team is here, they're running the conduit all throughout the house. So remember, the, uh, the electric is going to be encased in the concrete slab. So what we have to do is we have to plot out exactly where all the outlets are, all the lights are, and we're gonna come up from underneath. So the conduit gets laid out. Later on, the electric wires will get snaked through the conduit, come up where the boxes are, ready to rock and roll. So as you see, as you pan out across the house, you see exactly how the electrical plant is laid out, exactly where everything comes up out of the wall. We cut these little grooves where everything fits right through for the exterior walls. And it's a perfect, perfect setup. Safer, better, faster. So as you can see, we are flying through this build. You've seen the excavation, you've seen the plumbing, you've seen the forms, you've seen the footings, you're seeing the foundation, you're seeing the electric, you're seeing why automating construction is the way of the future and why SQ4D is without question the best in the business.